good morning and this is going to be a fun day uh, we're actually going to come out and start bringing our deck and hulls together um, it's a beautiful day here on the pond so I'm just going to open up the, the barn and get things ready and that's what we're going to do today is bring these two puppies together. So now I have these out here. One is a lot easier to set up than the other. This one here actually sits in that cradle really nice. This one here doesn't. But that's okay. We'll we'll make do with what we've got. It's only very very temporary anyway. So we'll get all of these out of the way everything looks good except of exception of this right here we've really got to work on that before we do anything because that is really in there it must have happened when we Hold that out so I'll get this taken care of get that popped back out and then we can probably mix some of the epoxy and get this going so I'll be right back well, we are about as set up outside as we can be. I'm going to take a few things out of my pocket here. Um, we're going to cover up really well. Since we're going to be kind of in, in the thick of things. This may just be a little bit tad overkill, but I'm not going to be in it long and minimizing the itch and all of that is coming.
So it is extremely hot out here and I'm trying to record as many places that I can, but so you can kind of tell we've got one side in on both of those. So we're going to flip the boats and then do the other side. Once those are done, we can just let them dry. Now, the one thing I did find is that I can only reach to about here. So I put what I need to all the way up here. That'll hold that together. And then once we get working on the other side, we'll probably put some more epoxy filler in on the fronts of these. But we're just gonna continue and I'll flip these and we'll continue getting these things done not easy well it's 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 okay it's not that bad but um, it's starting to heat up it's about 9 10 here and I want to get this done so the next part of this is done we've got the inside of that on both sides uh, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna mix up some epoxy so that we can take and do the same thing we did with those strips and then once those strips are on we'll just take and make sure that uh, there's no drips and uh, we'll, we're going to call it a day at that point. We're going to let this stuff dry and I'm going to get out of this suit. Uh, it's probably about 80 now, maybe a little higher. But let's get that taken care of and we can call this done. Wow. I know I say wow a lot but uh, this is finished. So I've got all of this in. I am gonna have to take and sand, I know that. Um, we'll set this like this to allow that to dry a little bit better. Um, that is all sealed as best as it can be. Looks like there was some movement on some of these, but nothing that can't be sanded down. Um, actually, the attachments look really good as I'm looking through here. Of course, there's a lot of just runs there, but that's going to be a hatch. And I'll sand those down. I'll get something in there and probably do some more work on those. But this is it. Um, these are actually, would you actually call them a boat or a kayak by now? because it does have the hull and the deck attached. But we're getting there. Um, we'll unstrap everything here. We'll give it a few hours, unstrap it all, and uh, check the handiwork. But I'm gonna get out of these clothes and we're gonna let all of this stuff dry so that we can pick it up without getting too much of a mess all over the place. I do think I'm gonna sit down and have some coffee since I haven't had any from this morning. Uh, thanks for, well, we'll be back in just a little bit and we'll unwrap these and we'll take another look a little later today. So after a little cleaning up of the messes, um, we're gonna let this kind of finish out drying. It is pretty good to really feel on the inside. It's, it's dry, but uh, there's a few pieces in there that I really want to, to get a lot more dry, so that's just what we'll do. Uh, I do have some nails in here. We may wait, let's just wait. Till we know that that is completely dry then we'll pull those out so a lot of work on the whole the the deck after we're done but let's just sit down here and we'll admire them a little bit pull the tractor in and maybe go to lunch well we've given a good amount of time to let these dry and i think they're going to be fine it's about 91 out so what I'm going to do is take all the straps off 
and then we'll put them back up. Um, but uh, we'll let them finish its drying inside the barn. Well, I'm thinking this actually means we have two boats, two kayaks. Uh, there's still a lot of work that needs to be done on these. Um, we've got to get the combing in. We've got to do a lot of sanding to the decks. But uh, they are married together. So we've got the hull and the deck together. Now we'll come back in here and do some work to bring these two together to seal this all up. But uh, I'm real happy with what we're seeing here. That'll be it from the bucket list project for today. Uh, if you like the content, make sure you subscribe, uh, hit the thumbs up if, if you really like it, and then make sure to turn on those post notifications to catch all the episodes. We will catch you later.